Wagner Group continues to recruit militants for war in Ukraine. The Wagner private military company is continuing to recruit fighters for the war in Ukraine throughout Russia, despite Yevgeny Prigozhin's failed rebellion attempt. BBC noted that they have called dozens of numbers of recruitment centers located in Russia. The journalists told the centers that they were applying at their brother's request and were interested in the possibility of joining the war against Ukraine as part of the Wagner Group. In particular, a woman from the Viking Sports Club in Murmansk, Russia, confirmed that the club was still recruiting fighters for the war in Ukraine. The BBC noted that Wagner Group's long list of contacts is based mainly on fight clubs such as martial arts schools and boxing clubs. Several people who answered the phone call emphasized that the new recruits sign contracts with Wagner Group, but not with the Russian Defense Ministry. It's absolutely nothing to do with the Defense Ministry, said the Sparta Sports Club in Volgograd. Nothing has stopped. We're still recruiting. We are working. If something has changed, they'd have told us. But there's nothing. A female recruiter in Krasnodar said firmly. The U.S. Department of Defense has information that some of the mercenaries of the Russian Wagner private military company are still on the Russian-occupied territory of Ukraine. On Wagner Group and its disposition, what I would tell you is, right now, we continue to see some elements of the Wagner Group in Russian-occupied territory in Ukraine. General Patrick Ryder, the Pentagon Press Secretary, said, 